What's up guys, Eric. I'm finally out here with the uh, the, the new uh, Arma Rally car that I built. Uh, we've had so much rain and storms here lately, it's just, uh, just, just about impossible to get out anywhere with the other trucks. So I figure I'll finally finish this thing up. Um, I'm just anxious to give it a rip out here in the street and you know, we'll just see where it goes. Uh, real quick, I finally got a few more things done on it. I kind of I kind of lightly went over it in my last uh, last video. It's kind of a rough draft of it. Um, but I finally got the sitting cages in and side skirts here just to kind of really help, you know, protect the body. And I did on the inside of the body, like I usually do, a little piece of foam taped into the roof up there so it rests on top of the uh, cage up here. And um, I did find some of uh, my little junk box. I found some little uh, mud, uh, some mud guards, like from an Outcast or Creighton. I was able to, you know, put in here too to kind of help, kind of help with the, uh, with the mud getting in and dirt and stuff. Um, again, it does have, it's got the Arma BLX uh, a 185 ESC with a Turnigy, a 2000 KV uh, motor with a, with a 20 tooth pinion. Uh, right now I'm running a stock diff or like, you know, my bashing diff setup. Uh, but I did go, because uh, it does have Sentin shocks on it, Sentin towers um, on the shocks. I did go 2000 CST just to kind of stiffen it up a little bit, kind of like the Italian, uh, you know, for, for some nice, nice smooth handling. So we'll just, we'll just see how it goes. Um, it does have the M2C, a three millimeter racing chassis on it. I figure it'd be a perfect, uh, perfect application for this car, you know, along with the M2C uh, locking suspension blocks back here. So um, I'm just gonna give this thing kind of a shakedown run out here and see how it does. And um, I mean, I'm just really stoked about this. I've always wanted a little, a little rally car street build. Um, you know, again, this is the Lancia. This is like the 1980s uh, Lancia a rally car body from uh, Delta Plastics. I mean, it's a really rigid body, real nice. Because uh, I just wanted to go with that old school look, you know. <clears throat> you know, and again, in the rear, it does have the T-bone, uh, like a T-bone, part of a T-bone wheelie bar. And I even threw on some, some little mud flaps to kind of give it that scale look. So, <laughs> all right, guys, let's give it a quick rip, see what's up. Alright guys, I came out here to this uh, spot. I don't know if you guys recognize this. If you've been following my channel for a while, this is uh, where I used to come a lot, a long time ago, where I had two big, uh, nice flat uh, dirt pads up here, and I used to jump, you know, off the up to the bank and stuff. So now there's like, now there's like storage buildings here. They seem to be vacant, and there's some nice uh, big gravel area. So I'm just gonna play around out here for a little bit and uh, see what's up. That was crazy.
right guys that's gonna be it for now uh, it's kind of a short video i just wanted to give it a quick shakedown run um you know i may still need to adjust you know the diffs and stuff uh this is just kind of a, just a just a quick test and tune to see how she handles i did raise the suspension a little bit and i put, ended up putting stiffer springs on it all the way around uh, especially before i came out here and hit this gravel and more off-road areas uh, before i had it set up you know mainly for for street so but i definitely want to be able to hit up you know both terrains and um but it's uh you know something different you know it's not a it's not a sending vehicle it's just to just have fun and rip around and do some drifts and stuff so but anyway all right guys a lot of fun and we'll see you guys next time rc duty one peace out